Let's give you some details coming on the issues relating to the leadership of the APC, the ruling party in Nigeria. Well, the leaders of the party in the three senatorial district of Kwara State have urged the national leadership of the party to correct what they termed non redeemable uh, or non redeem of uh, electoral promises and victimization of the standing president or risk them dumping the party. They were addressing journalists today in alarming the chairman of the Kwara South Senatorial District while speaking on behalf of the three elders, noted that the party has failed in its promises of job creation and living standard of the common man. Well, the latest that we're bringing for you right about now, there is a parallel group emerging from the ruling APC. They said they have been betrayed, their expectations completely dashed, according According to them, the APC has run a ruderless, in, in inept, and incompetent government that has failed to deliver good governance to the Nigerian people. They faulted the just concluded APC convention and named their executives. At the press conference addressed by Elijah Buba Galadima, the national chairman of the reformed All Progressive Congress, RAPC, the APC government has been a monumental disaster, even worse than the government is replaced. A political party that was a vehicle for enthroning the government was rendered powerless by manipulations and complete lack of due process in its operations. Those are the statements by the now reformed APC, a new group out of the APC. So let's get perspective to this one. And I have chieftains of the APC to talk to us on this one tonight. I have Senator Ayu Arishi, a former Senator of the Federal Republic. And also I have Honorable Clarice Auburn, a former lawmaker and a chieftain of the APC. Thank you so much, gentlemen. It's uh, an interesting day and things are happening so fast. Let me begin with you, Honorable Auburn. This is happening and now it does look like things are falling apart quickly. We are having meetings of um, the senators with the leadership of the party party before this one came what do you think is the future of the party based on what has happened today precisely what has happened and what is about to happen to APC and what is happening to APC is uh, the uh, the remnants of what uh, the last administration of APC has given to us and I think the fit and proper person that will deal with this is the president national chairman it is not a new path for him to follow. As a former national leader of the labor movement in this country, the most turbulent of periods under the military and this period, I do think that Comrade Adam Sushimole is again brought to a familiar terrain, and that terrain is crisis management. What the members are doing is a due process or democratic process where the expression of political and democratic interests are being exhibited. So Buba Galadima has indeed uh, become... For me, a quintessential example of a democratic process and internal democracy in APC. Of course, he did not give you a new name. He says he's a reformed APC. That's what he wishes it to be. There is no party registered in Nigeria called reformed APC. So all he's saying is, I'm a part of this. You have to recognize me. You have to give that. It is his due right to do so, and it's in the common interest of APC to allow for this process to reach its a logical conclusion. Like you rightly noted, the Venture National Assembly, they are back in the Secretary as I speak to you now. Before I got into the studio, I'm aware that the NWC is meeting with those who are aggrieved, and don't be surprised by tomorrow morning that Boba Galadima will be on the same channel to announce to you that he expressed his grievances and they have been attended to. This new APC, under the leadership of Adam Soshimole, is certainly going to chart a new course, and internal democracy is going to be at All work. right. So nobody's okay. going to be punished so, and nobody's going to be allowed to go. Okay, then. Uh, we will come back from a, this break. We'll go on a break. And when we come back, we'll hear from Senator Arishe. It looks so much that some of the troubles are from the Senate, where a lot of our give members of the party are. They've met with the NWC and Mr. Adams or Shomale earlier today. We'll also hear from Elijah Buba Galadima on the program tonight and what led to the reformed APC. Don't go anywhere. He just got started on the program, everyone. Thank you so much, everyone, for staying with us. The drums of defection is beating loud and clear in the APC. The breaking news we're following for you is that Buba Galadima led faction of the APC have emerged this evening. It's called the Reformed APC. Where does the APC go from here? Just days away, 
was Adams Oshimale emerging as the national chairman of the party. So where then is the peace that the party has promised that will return to it? So 